is Mike Joseph, Culinary Manager for Rich Products Corporation. And if you want to add a little diversity into your menu, especially your dessert menu, let's look at the Rich's Easy Flan Mix. Very simple. It has a 365 day shelf life in the freezer, 270 days unopened in the refrigerator, and 90 days ambient unopened. So let's show you how easy it is to make a wonderful ethnic flan. Once you've got it out, you want to uh, put it on your burner and bring it to a boil. Probably one or two minutes. You want to periodically stir this. You don't want it to overboil, but you want to uh, make sure that it does come to a simmering boil so that the starches and uh, ingredients in there start to mesh together. So once it starts to come to a boil, you want it to boil for approximately one to two minutes at a low simmer. Uh, constantly stir it at this point, and uh, once that has been done, you're now ready to assemble your flan. We're going to pour it into a measuring container. It just makes it, once again, easy to pour the flan into your containers. And you see that this does make one quart of flan mix. You want to take some caramel uh, syrup and you're going to place approximately an eighth of an inch on the bottom of your flan dish. So you could use any size that you want. I'm using ramekins here. So I'm going to put approximately about a tablespoon to uh, two tablespoons of caramel mix into the bowls. Now that you have your caramel sauce in your bowls, you're ready now to pour your flan in. This one's going to be about six ounces of uh, flan mix. You don't want it all the way to the top. You want to leave a little bit of a lip, and then it makes it easier for one to transport back to the refrigerator because this is a no-bake flan. This will make uh, anywhere from six to 10 flans. You could even get 12, depending on the size of your bowl. So now let's take this to the refrigerator. Let's let it set. And once it's cooled, we'll show you how to finish it off. Now that the flans had set, let's show you how to unmold them. What you want to do is you want to take a sharp object and just uh, kind of break the, uh, the seal up at the top here. Once that happens, what you're going to do is you're going to take your flan, okay, and you're simply going to put your plate on top and just dump it down like this. Give it a second or two, and there you have it, flan, a very traditional ethnic dish done very easily. Bon Appetit. For more information, contact us at riches.com.